Okay, but the problem is machine learning sucks compared to what we observe in humans and animals. I'm going to argue that the type of AI systems that we, uh, we have at the moment, um, uh, or, or that everybody is you know, playing with, almost everybody is playing with, uh, do not have the right characteristics uh, for, for what we want. And the reason is uh, they basically produce one token after the other autoregressively, right? So you have a sequence of tokens, which are subword units, but it doesn't matter what they are, a sequence of symbols. And then you have a predictor that is repeated uh, over the sequence that basically, basically take a window uh, of previous tokens and predict the next token. So the way those things are trained is you take a sequence and you basically train the system to just reproduce its input on its output. And because it has a causal structure, um, it cannot cheat and use a particular input to predict itself. It has to only look at the symbols that are to the left of it. That's called a causal architecture. And there's an issue with this, which is that um, the, the, that process is basically divergent. Every time you produce a token, there is some chance that the token is not within the set of reasonable answers and take you outside the set of reasonable answers. And if it does that, there is no way to fix it afterwards. Um, and if there is, if you assume there is some probability for that, you know, wrong token, uh, for wrong tokens to be generated and the errors are independent, which of course they're not, um, then you get exponential divergence, uh, which is why, you know, we have with those models hallucination issues. In the discussion towards AGI, we're often missing this kind of nuance of current performance of stuff that we've built versus their shortcomings. It doesn't mean they are not useful at all. It's just that to get to general intelligence, we kind of need to fix them. I think that the argument of the folks who kind of want to like keep scaling again and again to fix these shortcomings is a bit weird. It shows you how far we got into the AI summer that we just have to ask for more money to get better results and we just get the money. I think we need to come back to open research discussion about these models and not just take like for granted what the closed source model folks are saying. Because then we get into like this weird discussion about hype, the marketing aspect, the fact that they have investors and they need to show return and then they are locked in into like the GPT and transformer architecture and stuff. I think if we don't highlight these shortcomings in an open science way like before AI and machine learning used to be are gonna hit AI winter pretty hard if the scaling is not enough.